नमस्ते टू एवरी वन आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन माय यूट्यूब वीडियो चैनल टुडे आई विल डेली वार लेक्चर ऑन थ्योरी ऑफ नंबर्स लेक्चर नंबर फिफ्टी इन व्हिच आई विल डिस्कस लैगरेंजेस थ्योरम ऑन सॉल्यूशन ऑफ कंग्रुएंसेस Now we state Lagrange's theorem statement. Let P be a prime number, and let f x equal to a n x to the power n plus a n minus one x to the power n minus one plus dot 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 plus a one x plus a naught be a polynomial of degree n. n is greater than equal to 1 with integral coefficients and p does not divide ai ai be the coefficient of polynomials that is ai is not congruent to zero modulo p then congruence fx is congruent to zero modulo p has at most n in congruent solutions modulo p now we prove this prove we shall prove the theorem by method of induction for n equal to 1 f x equal to in place of n we write one a one x plus a naught. Now congruence f x is congruent to zero modulo p. Here p be the prime number implies that. A one x plus a naught is congruent to zero modulo p. Implies that a one x is congruent to minus a naught modulo p. This is a linear congruence since. P is a prime number, and P does not divide a one. That means, GCD of P and a one equal to one. That means, this congruence has one incongruent solution. Now we write this. Since P does not divide a one, and P is a prime number. Therefore, GCD of P and a one equal to one. Let this is one. This is Two. Therefore, the linear congruence two has one incongruent solution. Therefore, for n equal to one. The linear congruence f x is congruent to zero modulo p has one incongruent solution. Therefore, theorem is true for 
n equal to 1. Now let the theorem is true for n minus 1. Therefore, if a fx is a polynomial of degree n minus 1 then the congruence fx is congruent to 0 modulo p has at most n minus 1 in congruent solution. Let this is number 3. Now let fx is a polynomial of degree n. And the congruence fx is congruent to 0 modulo p has n plus 1 in congruent solutions. Let this is number 4. Now, let R1, R2, dot, 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 Rn, Rn plus 1, Rn plus 1, in Kalegruven solutions, of fx is congruent to 0 modulo p where fx is a polynomial of degree n. Let this is number 5. Therefore, F in place of X we write R1 is congruent to 0 modulo P. Now, in place of X we write R2. F R2 is congruent to 0 modulo p dot 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 in place of x we write Rn plus 1 is congruent to 0 modulo p we may write these solutions as if r1 is congruent to 0 modulo p and if rm is congruent to 0 modulo p m equal to 2 3 dot 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 n plus 1 let the number 6 the 7 and this 8 
since Fx is a polynomial of degree n. So we may write Fx equal to a n x to the power n plus a n minus 1 x to the power n minus 1 plus dot 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 plus a 1 x plus a naught. This is number 9. Therefore, fx minus fr1 equal to fx is a n x to the power n plus a n minus 1 x to the power n minus 1 plus dot 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 plus a1 x plus a0 minus a n r1 to the power n plus a n minus 1 r1 to the power n minus 1 plus dot 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 plus a1 r1 plus a0 and this is equal to a n x to the power n minus r1 to the power n plus a n minus 1 x to the power n minus 1 minus r1 to the power n minus 1 plus dot 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 plus dot 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 plus a1 x minus r1 let this is number 10 implies that fx minus f r1 equal to a n here x to the power n minus r1 to the power n. This means x minus r1 multiply x to the power n minus 1 plus x to the power n minus 2 r1 plus x to the power n minus 3 r1 square plus dot 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 plus x r1 to the power n minus 2 plus r1 to the power n minus 1 plus a n minus 1 multiply this equal to x minus r1 multiply under bracket by x to the power n minus 2 plus x to the power n minus 3 multiply r1 plus dot 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 plus r1 n minus 2 plus dot 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 plus a1 x minus r1 now we take common x minus r1 we see that in each term we have x minus r1 as a factor so we take common x minus r1 multiply we write another remaining terms here a n x to the power n minus 1 plus a n multiply r1 plus a n minus 1 under bracket multiply x to the power n minus 2 plus dot 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 plus under bracket a n r1 to the power n minus 1 plus a n minus 1 r1 to the power n minus 2 plus dot 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 plus a1 multiply 
x plus a n r1 to the power n minus 1 plus dot 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 plus a1. We may write this as x minus r1 multiply. This is a function of x gx where gx is a polynomial of degree n minus 1. Here maximum power of x is n minus 1. Let this is number 11. Here we see that gx be a polynomial which is under this curly bracket. Here coefficient of this polynomial be here a n here a n multiply r 1 plus a n minus 1 and so on. We know that P is a prime number and P does not divide the coefficient of the polynomials of degree n that is P does not divide a n P does not divide a n minus 1 dot 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 P does not divide a 1 P does not divide a naught therefore P does not divide the coefficients of gx since gx is a polynomial of degree n minus 1 and P does not divide the coefficients of this polynomial from 7 and 8 we get f r m minus f r 1 is congruent to 0 modulo p where m equal to two theory dot 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 n plus 1. Let this is number 12. Putting x equal to rm in 11. We get frm minus f r 1 equal to r m minus r 1 g r m m equal to 2 theory dot 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 n plus 1 let this is number 13 using 13 in 12 we get r m minus r 1 multiply g r m is congruent to 0 modulo P. This is number 14. 
since Rm and R1 are incongruent solutions. Therefore, Rm is not congruent to R1 modulo P implies that Rm minus R1 is not congruent to 0 modulo P. This is number 15. Using 15 in 14 we get GRM is congruent to 0 modulo P M equal to 2 3 dot 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 N plus 1 therefore GX congruent to 0 modulo P has here we get n number of m. So, gx congruent to 0 modulo p has n number of incongruent solutions. But, Gx is a polynomial of degree n minus 1. So, it has n minus 1 number of incongruent solutions. This is number 16 and this is number 17. So, 16 and 17 contradict with each other. Therefore, our assumption if a fx is a polynomial of degree n, then the congruence fx is congruent to 0 modulo p has n plus 1 number of solutions is wrong. Now we write this. Therefore, 16 and 17 contradict with each other. Hence, our assumption if a fx is a polynomial of degree n and fx is congruent to 0 modulo p has n plus 1 number of in congruent solutions is wrong. Therefore, if fx is a polynomial of degree n then the congruence fx is congruent to 0 modulo p has at most a number of 
इन कैलगरूमेंट सोल्यूशन देर फॉर थियोरम इज प्रूफ नाउ वी प्रूफ द नेक्स्ट थियोरम नेक्स्ट थियोरम इज लेट पी बी ए प्राइम नंबर एंड लेट डी डिवाइड पी माइनस वन देन द कंग्रुवेंस एक्स टू दी पावर डी माइनस वन इज कंग्रुवेंट टू जीरो मोडुलो पी Has exactly d solutions. Now we prove this. Since given that p be a prime number and d divides p minus one, implies that. P minus one equal to d multiply an integer a. A belongs to Z. Let this is number one. We may write P minus one equal to d plus a minus one into d. Here. D here minus D cancel only remains A D D A. This is number two. Therefore x to the power p minus one minus one equal to x to the power in place of p minus one we write D plus A minus one into D minus one. We may write this as x to the power D minus one multiply x to the power A minus one D plus x to the power A minus two into D plus dot 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 plus X to the power d plus one equal to x to the power d minus one multiply f x. Let this is number three. F x equal to the terms under this bracket, where f x equal to x to the power a minus one into d plus x to the power a minus two into d plus dot 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 plus x to the power d plus one. Let this is number four. Therefore, f x is a polynomial of Degree a minus one into d. From theory, any solution of x to the power p minus one minus one congruent zero modulo p is a solution. Of here we get two factors x to the power d minus one or f x modulo p from Fermat's Little Theorem. If a p does not divide b, then b to the power p minus one is congruent to one modulo p. This is number 
फाइव वी मे टेक वैल्यूज ऑफ बी एज वन टू डॉट 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 पी माइनस वन बिकॉज पी डज नॉट डिवाइड दिज नंबर्स वी मे राइट बी इक्वल टू एक्स देन फाइव रेड्यूसेस टू एक्स टू दी पावर पी माइनस वन इज कैन गुरुवेंट टू वन मॉडुलो पी दिस इज नंबर सिक्स इंप्लाइज दैट एक्स टू दी पावर पी माइनस वन माइनस वन इज कैन गुरुवेंट टू जीरो मॉडुलो पी दिस इज नंबर सेवेन सिंस वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स इज बी एंड बी मे टेक वैल्यूज वन टू डॉट 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 पी माइनस वन दे आर फॉर द कंग्रुवेंस सेवन हैज पी माइनस वन नंबर ऑफ इन कंग्रू एंड सोल्यूशन सिंस एफेक्स इज ए पॉलिनिमियल ऑफ डिग्री ए माइनस वन इंटू डी दे आर फॉर बाय लगर थियोरम एफ एक्स इज कलगुरु एंड टू जीरो मोडुलो पी हैज एटमोस्ट ए माइनस वन इंटू डी नंबर ऑफ इन कलगुरु एंड सोल्यूशन लेट दिस इज नंबर सेवेन Since x to the power p minus one minus one equal to x to the power d minus one multiply f x and x to the power p minus one minus one congruent to zero modulo p has p minus one. नंबर ऑफ इन कैलग्रुवेंट सोल्यूशन हियर कैलग्रुवेंट सेवेन हैज पी माइनस वन नंबर ऑफ इन कैलग्रुवेंट सोल्यूशन एंड एफ एक्स इज कैलग्रुवेंट टू जीरो मॉड्यूल ऑफ पी हैज एटमोस्ट ए माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई बाय डी नंबर ऑफ इन कैलग्रुवेंट सोल्यूशन therefore x to the power d minus 1 is congruent to 0 modulo p has at least p minus 1 minus a minus 1 into d equal to p minus 1 equal to ए डी माइनस ए माइनस वन इंटू डी इक्वल टू डी नंबर ऑफ सोल्यूशन बट एक्स टू दी पावर डी माइनस वन इज ए पॉलिनेमियल of a degree d 
देआरफोर बाय लैग्रेंजेस थ्योरम x टू दी पावर d माइनस वन कंग्रुएंट टू जीरो मॉडुल ओपी हैज एट मोस्ट d नंबर ऑफ इनकंग्रुएंट सॉल्यूशंस लेट दिस इज नंबर एट दिस इज नंबर नाइन हियर इन एट वी सी दैट x to the power d minus 1 congruent to 0 modulo p has at least d number of solutions and in 9 x to the power d minus 1 congruent to 0 modulo p has at most d number of solutions that means x to the power d minus 1 congruent to 0 modulo p has exactly d number of incongruent solutions proved thanks for watching my video if you are satisfied with my presentation and contents then please click on like button and do subscribe my youtube channel thank you